Okay, people, so here's the deal. Your girl, Kieran King, from <laughs> Love and Hip Hop Atlanta Season 5, excuse me for laughing, this is so not funny. You know how she was accused before of being, you know, some sort of a scam artist or whatever? Well, it looks like she was booked, placed in a jail cell for financial identity fraud. I'm going to read to you what NYDailyNews.com has to say about it. NYDailyNews.com writes, and I quote, One of America's most wanted is added again. Love and Hip Hop Atlanta star Karen K.K. King was booked early Tuesday with financial identity fraud, theft by taking, and first degree forgery. Fulton County Jail Records Show. The arrest first reported by Atlanta gossip site Straight From The A apparently occurred outside the Level V nightclub in Atlanta. A rep for King has not returned the daily news request for comment. Police did not make the new arrest report available, but confirmed to the news that it was related to a August 30th, 2015 embezzlement incident in Atlanta, where King and two another suspects, I guess they meant to say two other suspects, both Saks employees bought almost $5,000 worth of merchandise at Saks Fifth Avenue using a stolen credit card. She presented sales associate Armani Harper with a woman named Diane Woody's information according to the police report. Harper later admitted to police he knowingly rang sales that were being paid for with fraudulent credit cards and received kickbacks. King, a new cast member of the VH1 reality series, was featured on America's Most Wanted in 2012 for allegedly beating an ex-boyfriend, according to the Atlanta Journal-Constitution. She was later jailed in 2013. Ugh, excuse me, this tea is so bitter it has me stuttering. They left out the part that she was on the run for a year. That's why it took from 2012 to 2013 to catch her ass. She said, catch me later, bitches, and just went in the run. They had to play Where's Karen as opposed to Where's Waldo. Where in the world is Karen King? Fuck Carmen San Diego. Back to the story. King, a new cast member of the VH1 reality series, was featured on America's Most Wanted in 2012 for allegedly beating an ex-boyfriend, according to the Atlanta Journal-Constitution. She was later jailed in 2013 on charges of aggravated assault with intent to murder, kidnapping, armed robbery, and other offenses. In a video teaser for Love & Hip Hop Atlanta earlier this month, the reality star and former momager addressed her so-called murder for hire charges head on quote yes i was on the run yes i was on america's most wanted even my dog was on america's most wanted she said bluntly this woman is a mess i'm sorry anyway they end off this story by saying quote this is another karen king quote i've been to prison not one time but a few times it's unfortunate i made mistakes king continued but when you're a single mom and you don't want your kids to struggle, you might make some choices that are not so good. That's the end of the story. Let me just say this, Karen. Your sons are grown men now. You're, I think you're 51 or 52 years old. Your children have children. So are you doing this for the grandchildren now? Or are you still doing this for your children? Or what is the excuse for you getting arrested now? That's what I want to know. What in the world was she thinking? Did you really need a goddamn Louis Vuitton belt that bad at 50 fucking one? You gonna scam credit cards to get a Louis belt at 50? One? Ah. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So anyways, just because I think she's a trifling ass heifer. Doesn't mean that you do. Maybe you agree with this shit. Maybe you want to go and scam with her. Maybe you have scammers in Atlanta. <laughs> Didn't some dude say that in a song, uh, designer, the song Panda? Did he talk about his credit card scammers in Atlanta or something like that? I could have sworn he did, but the song is so retarded, it's hard for me to keep up with what was being said. The point is this, though. This shit is disgusting. When is she ever going to stop, if ever? I can see her at 80 years old now, like, well... I had to bust somebody upside the head with a pipe, and you know, and steal some credit cards and shit because I had to get my bingo money up. Like, really? And don't forget my collection plate money. Pass it on play. Like, really? I mean, this woman, she, she, I don't know whether to condemn her or to feel sorry for her. Anyways, what do you guys think, man? Forget my opinion. My opinion means nothing. It's it. You guys are the star of the show. The commenters and the comment section. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe 
to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. Let's make some guesses on how long she's going to be in jail when they, you know, after she goes to court and everything. Do you think that she should go to jail? If so, for how long do you think she should go? How long do you think she is going to go? Do you feel sorry for her? Let me know below. Meat Magazine on YouTube, meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus. Meat Magazine. Did I say it enough times?